So I'm almost 100% positive that every single one of you watching this video right now is well aware of the Zim 4 and the IO Gear adapters where the PlayStation 4, the Xbox One, or any of those consoles recognizes those as a controller, but you're really using a mouse and keyboard. I really feel like Sony needs to add this to the console, that or Microsoft needs to add it to their console because there's going to be people using those anyways if they want to use a mouse and keyboard but i wanted to show you guys how you can remap your controls inside of fortnite battle royale this is something that took me a really long time to figure out i also want to let you guys know that if you have a program on your computer where you can set profiles for your mouse or where you can set profiles for your keyboard to make it feel the way you want to you can go ahead and set a profile for that, put it on your mouse, put it on your keyboard, and then when you plug it into your PS4, it will still be the profile that you had set on your computer. Now bear with me here because it does. So when you, when you have your mouse and you're inside of Fortnite, you can use a controller for this part, but as you guys can see, like you see the little bubbles popping up, if you go all the way up, just move your mouse all the way to the right. Go down, go to settings, go to settings. And then if you just, you see how it's like, it's showing up. Input, we gotta go. Okay, so now if we go, you see how it's still showing up at the top. Make sure you go to your, it's a pain in the ass because it doesn't show your mouse, but. So when you go to game, just make sure Okay, there we go. And then once you're at this part, you can use your scroll wheel to go down. So like, for example, I'm gonna go to the building part. Those are the ones that I wanted to remap. So bindings for weapon slot three. Okay, right here, building slot one. See how it says it over on the right? When you click that, you hit your left mouse, go to just hit Q. And then if we use the mouse scroll, okay, that's Q. All right, that's slot two. Slot two. And then you hit your mouse and you just hit E. And that's how you remap your key settings inside of Fortnite. Like I said, guys, I really feel like Sony needs to just add this to their console. There's more and more games that are just adding this into their video games anyways. Um, you can go ahead and correct me if I'm wrong about this, but um, I'm pretty sure that Battlefield has support for mouse and keyboard as well. So now all you have, you don't have to hit apply or anything. It'll, you'll get used to it after a little bit here. Um, okay, there we go. As you guys can see, it'll save your profile. QE. That's, those are, that's really the, and then uh, crouch. I put as cap lock. Fuck. <laughs> it's a pain in the ass, guys. Really is. Okay, cool. And then the profiles that I have saved on my mouse to up the, um, I don't, I can't remember what it's called to make it so it moves quicker. DPI, the DPI. You can, uh, set profiles here you're gonna need a good mouse you're not gonna be able to have like a, a ten dollar mouse but if you have a mouse that allows you to add profiles to it like if you have like keys on the side of your mouse a thing or you know you can use this the profiles that you set like you can swap to the second profile the third profile the fourth profile i'm gonna keep it at the first profile though because that's the one that i want yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember to support it with a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.